Thank you, guys. So. So. Uh, yeah. <laughs> stuff? Money first. Bueno, bueno. Wait until I leave.
Thanks. Well, what time do you have? 12.45, senor. Gracias. Gracias, senor. I'm sorry. I'm very sorry. The least I can do is buy you some new ones. Oh, no, really. It was an accident. No, please don't. There you are. I wouldn't want to have it on my conscience. Besides, you might accuse me of murder. Thank you. I could. I had to shop for these. Oh, Pinetta, huh? Smart. <laughs> this will work. I should hate you. Don't ever do that. You're like a disease, Ernie. Everything you touch. Twist and kill. But you love me. Ferris was never late in his life. When he didn't show on time, I figured something must have happened. It did. Well, that's a nice clean job. He never lost a drop of blood. Whoever used that knife must have trained at med school. White age. That'll last up a few lives. Chief, we'd better close the border. The killer may still be here. Masandi, senor? That might be a lot of trouble. Murder usually is. State your citizenship, please. American. And you, ma'am? American. Did you buy anything in Mexico? Some toys for the kids. Turn into number three station down there for secondary customs inspection, please. Grab hold of your nerves and grab tight. How long were you in Mexico? Came over this morning. Where were you born? Baltimore. You, ma'am? 
Anything wrong? Both fights. Now, for me getting those horns, she wouldn't mind it a bit. Not one little bit. <laughs> Can you tell me where you were born, ma'am? Philadelphia. May I see your driver's license? Sure. Make any purchases? Just this for my little girl. The bull for my little boy. U.S. Customs, Santa Fe Bridge. This is Treasury Agent Maddow. Miss Gardner? Yeah? Okay, go ahead. Right. Right. Borders now closed until further notice. Please, friend, I've got a load back there delivered. All right, the border's closed. But, friend, it took me three days to find him. U.S. Treasury Department, Narcotics Division. Special Agent Farrell, please. Farrell speaking. Farrell, Maddow. Rough news. Carrera's got a knife in his back. He's dead and the stuff's gone. Sounds like a syndicate job. We closed up the border, but we still don't have any description of the killer. Henry just brought some new stuff in on Griggs. I'll bring it down. Might be a lead in it. How soon will you be here? I'm on my way. Let's go, Henry. Now listen, Frankie, when we lose that guard, we're gonna make a run for it, now you hear? Supposing Donna isn't under the bridge. Oh, come on, man. She said she'd make it, didn't she? Back to her cooler. Talking to Johnny. Probably heard some noise about a switch. Hey, what made you swing on Alex? His aim was too good. The wetbacks? They work in the fields, just like us. You know, Frankie, would you have cut him? I think he would have bled. What's important is coming out on top, being number one. How you do it don't matter. Look, Switch Boy, you're in here same as me. But you're in here because you're stupid. Taking a rap for a beat-happy chick. I was with her. And too hung up to know the car was hot. Wild. She just likes kicks. I told you her stepfather owns a ranch near the Panhandle, and my folks work for him. You want to be a nothing? Be stinking dirt cropper like your old man? I don't want to keep sweating in here. Well, you can thank me for putting brains in your skull. Well, you wouldn't get very far without wheels. Oh, who clued you how to get them? I don't like dragging Don in on this. She owes you a favor. I don't like it. Well, maybe she does. Well, do you want to be a lousy dirt cropper all the rest of your life? Gracias. <sighs> Stirred up quite a nest, didn't we? Well, so far we've seized a dozen sombreros and two bottles of tequila. Look, can't we let this hearse go through? No, I'm sorry. I'm here. That's all that really counts, isn't it, Frankie? Frankie, you sure make it tough on a guy low on vitamins. Oh, I'm sorry. Donna, this is Switch. Hello. No greeting? You know, like a brother to sister? Come on, we gotta get out of here. You're gonna cause a family feud doing things like that, Frankie. <laughs> you bring the clothes? In the back seat. Come on, let's go. 
Trouble getting the car? No, it's Bumble's car. He won't miss it. Who's Bumble? Handyman. He goes off on drunks. Disappears for days. He gone now? Hmm. I got him started. Yeah, I bet you did. <laughs> you think smart, sis? <laughs> Why do they call you Switch? Did they have you in there for using that? Yes, ma'am. My father. Kill him? Oh, no. I just scared him. He had to have a lesson. He got too quick with his hand. Sometimes I feel like sticking my stepfather. Oh, yeah? Why? When he beats my mother. Now, if that ever happens again, you just call it old switch. Be a real pleasure, you hear? I mean, us being brother and sister. You know, blood's thicker than water. Switch! Now, Frankie, you just ain't got no heart for family reunions. I'll drive. <laughs> Piece of well, what do we do now? We get rid of it. That's what we do now. Then what? Well, we've got our thumbs and we've got Donna. Well, come on. All right, let's push. You got it made, this. That'll be. That's someday, Switch. Today is now. All right, come on, let's go. Give me something. I can't make it. Later. I've got to have it now. Honey, I... You didn't give me that honey stuff before you was glad I was me. You were you and I was glad that was before. It'll be that way again. Ernie. You sweat it out till later. Hey, Clark.
business is slow. Don't worry about it, Frankie. Diamond here will help you pick up. You just start your engine and rev it up on the next car that comes along, you hear? Like this? Okay, Donna, turn off the ignition. What did they have at that farm, Frankie? Revival meetings. Hey, rev it up again, honey. Man, if that guy didn't see that, he must be dead. <laughs> Pick them up, Ernie. Be happy we're going to be a family. Safe travel insurance. You act like a good little girl, I'll give you a nice Mother's Day present. Later. Hop in, kids. Thanks, mister. Be my guests. Take a look at some photos. If you see a familiar face, holler. This is Griggs. He's head of the syndicate. We got him wired in Chicago. I've been seen in the company of Griggs. He's a killer, might be the one we're after. This is Sam. Change the tire for you, mister. Thanks. Kids are on your way to Dallas. Yeah, we just came down for the bullfight. That's a pretty long hitch, especially with a girl. Well, I think we can take care of ourselves. Sure. Your parents let you go? Sure. They're broad-minded. They let us do what we like. Well, we'll take you all the way to Dallas. Hold on. What about Bumble's car? Who cares about Bumble? You know, Donna, this cat is square and a half. Forget about that chicken. You stick with me and we'll have a wild ride, huh?
That's it, mister. because he had a woman with him. She was acting kind of sick. He said they'd been at the bullfight. Are you sure it was these two? Know them? Well, I saw the woman. I was waiting for Carreras. She was buying a toy bull and a doll from a street vendor. I bumped into her and broke the doll. I, I bought her a new one. A new doll. Open the border. Get out and APB, Henry. Roadblocks on all routes out of El Paso. Right. What's the matter with her, mister? You better get her to a doctor, mister. She looks bad. Ernie. Shut up. Ernie. Hey! Hey, what does she want? A bell, anything. Give it to her. She'll drink it. Sorry you kids had to see that. It's the only way I could uh, stop her. Can I help? You'd better let us out, mister. We'll hitch another ride. What's the matter? It's our choice. Hey, are you crazy? I said I'd take you all the way to Dallas. We changed our minds. We don't want to go to Dallas. No. Mr. Pull over. I said I'll take you all the way to Dallas. Come on, pull it over. Take it easy. We're headed in the wrong direction for us. Make better time. I said pull over. You give me no choice. Now what? We're stepping off. Come on. Forget about him. Let's go. Go on, punk. Show your stuff. It's me or you. You got the edge. But I don't think you got the guts. Look, mister, we're in trouble just like you. We just escaped from an honor farm. Big timers, huh? No trouble, no trouble at all. We just want to get out. Go on. Why don't you? <laughs> I'm just letting you off. Yeah. Come on. Come on. Will you be all right? I'll be all right, honey. The 
Who thinks a dirt pulls a knife on me? Did you see him? He tried to kill me. Let's get out of here. Should have sliced him when I had the chance. He must be the one that federal man was after. Yeah. Well, come on, let's go. Wait a minute. Well, that'll cut his water. All right, come on, let's go. Wait a minute, wait. Here's a present for you. Oh, please. Please let me keep the doll. Please. Well, you can have the doll. Oh, she flipped. Come on. Wait! You can have that. Hey, wait a minute. She was too big for dolls anyway. Those kids, I'll slice them up like cheese. Oh, two kids broke out of the honor farm. Oh, it just makes it all the tougher on them when they get caught. Do you think you can catch them? Oh, how far can they get? A couple of kids on foot. That's mighty good coffee, Ed. It's the same kind you get every day. You insinuating I'm a freeloader? Well, no, I wouldn't say a thing like that. Oh, of course not. <laughs> well, say, Jim. Yeah? When you're heading back this way, would you mind stopping and picking up a new prescription of pills that Ben has ready for me? Oh, sure. I'll see you. And don't forget, keep an eye out for those kids. Sure, I'll catch them for you. Yeah. <laughs> Look, you aren't adding up to anything. Look, you shut up. Don't tell me to shut up. I'm not your girl. Yeah, I know you're not. You're Chicken's girl. Who was Chicken in the car? You're awfully brave with girls. Frankie! Frankie! Okay, switch boy. Oh. Okay, switch. You lost your edge. <laughs> Look, Frank, it's no sense us fighting. We're in a spot. Yeah. Would you just tell her to keep off my back? Don't you worry about it. All right. Let's go. Hey, wait a minute. Just to show there's no hard feelings, Donna. 
Howdy. A car stuck. What's wrong with it? Distributor. What kind of car are you driving? Plymouth Suburban. No matter, breaker points? Ah, some kids hitchhiking ripped it out. Hey, that must be the two kids that escaped from the honor farm. State trooper was just here looking for them. Yeah? What's the matter, your wife ailing? She's got the virus. Well, bring her on in here in the office. Put her in here. On a couch. She said she's looking pretty green. Yeah. You know, it's going to take me a couple hours to fix that car of yours. A couple hours? Oh, I don't think I distribute around here to work. Can't wait. Got to get her to a doctor. The only doctor around here is old Doc Travis. He's got a cabin up there by Conscious Lodge, about five miles up the road. Me, homie's gone fishing. I'll go out to the garage and see if I can put something together and get you rolling. I haven't got anything out there to work. I'll have to drive into Housley and pick up a distributor. I think not. What do you mean? I said I think not. Well, I don't understand. Give me the keys to the car outside. My wagon? Yeah. Oh, you must be kidding. I only say it once, Mac. They're hanging there on the wall. The smallest one. Diet, Mac. Well, lucky we'll find those kids up the road. any brains to wash.
There's a house up here. Come on, let's go up. I found some clothes for you. Oh, thank you, Frankie. Well, no food, nothing. Uh, would you two Boy Scouts get some wood for the fire? I'm cold and wet, and I'd like to change. Come on, Switch, give her a break. about as rotten as they come, Switch. When they made the mold, they threw yours away. I just may have myself a, a new mold, Frankie. All platinum. You know what this stuff is? It's horse. Heroin? Yes, siree. Like Fort Knox in your hip pocket. Man, we're in big league. No wonder she wanted it. Wanted it. Needed it. That's what was wrong with her. She was on it. She's a junkie. Well, they'll be coming after it. So, we'll head for the border. Once inside old Mexico, we can make the right connections. Mexico? That stuff just came from there. Why take it back? Because down there, it'll be easy to fence wholesale. That's why. Yeah, and get fenced in. Uh, uh Frankie, this stuff is open sesame, man. It's going to introduce us to the right circles. It's going to make us big. I don't want it. If this stuff does what it did to that woman, I don't want it. I thought you wanted a ride. Not that kind. Donna's right. Great A chicken, small time. Yeah, we're gonna stay that way. All righty. If you don't want it, then I'll just uh, do it alone. Not with this. We're gonna turn it in. What are you, a happy little Easter bunny or something? Just don't plan to make money off of junkies. Oh, come on, Frankie. Now, they're gonna get it anyway. We're just doing them a favor, that's all. We'll let somebody else do them favors. Okay, Frankie. Yeah, I guess you're right. If we got caught with that stuff, it would give us a pretty big stretch now, wouldn't it? You bet we would.
All right, let's get the firewood. Oh, we can't stay here. They'll be coming after us. Them? They're running from the feds. Now, relax. Car 1-4. Car 1-4 to headquarters. Come in, Car 1-4. This is Trout. I'm up at Erickson's place. He's dead. Murdered. 10-4, is that Ed Erickson's at Cedar Hill? Right. Okay. Just received a 10-5 from PD. There's been a murder at Cedar Hill about five miles back down the road. That might be a lead for us. Thanks. Yes, sir. Rabbits are no different than people sometimes. They get scared. Like us, Frankie? I'm scared. I've never been so scared in my whole life. Everything will be all right. I hope so. It's like we're rolling down a long, steep hill with no end to it. No stopping. We'll stop, Donna, only we'll stop the right way. How are we going to stop, Frankie? We'll stop. Every ride's got to come to an end, this one included. We'll get off. Hey, look, it's not trembling anymore. It's not scared anymore. He's still warm when I got here. I looked around and his car's missing. Where is he? Inside. All right. Well, two have certainly been gone a long time. Yeah. Well, one big happy family again. What are you going to do, Mr. Now, you don't want to have any of those spoiling surprises, do you? That isn't even surprise number one, but it'll do for the minute. That's for the rock. Ernie, it's not in the doll. All right, who wants to do the telling? So that's how it is. Find it, Ernie, find it. All right, you. Where is it? Oh, please, can't tell him. Can't. Maybe you won't have to wait for your surprise. I can give it to you now. I can give your girlfriend a face that won't go with the rest of her body. 
<laughs> be kind of ashamed to. They go so well together. Yeah. I get done with you, I make you the number one freak in the side show at a circus. Switch! Here! So you took the stuff. That's right, I took it. Smart. Maybe smarter than you think. How about it, kid? Just enough for her. I'll pay you for it. <laughs> Somehow you're not getting through to me at all. So you think you're smart. But I'll tell you something. I've got a gun I can reach for and I can blast your guts out. But you're too stupid. How far do you think you'll get? All the way. With the feds on the loose and the local law looking for you right now? Yeah. The fellow over at the service station told me. The ranger spread the word on you. What are you selling, mister? Big league, kid. That's what you want, isn't it? Don't fall for that line switch. Shut up. Yeah. I think you're coming through to me now. I'm Big Lee, member of a big syndicate. You won't have to take the long road to the top. I can issue in shortcut. Yeah, right to the nearest cemetery. <sighs> Your friend's got a sense of humor. What about my cut of the stuff? You'll get yours, kid. We gotta start out with mutual trust. You see? I wasn't kidding you. Where is it, kid? I got it hidden. Just so they don't lose their good manners. She's a nervous case, don't test her. Let's go. Sorry. You wouldn't understand how it is. You wouldn't understand. It's you I'm sorry for, lady. Okay. Take it easy. I almost went off the deep end for you. You wanted a wild ride? Just as you said, knife was all right. Went into a main artery clean as a whistle. All the betting around here was at a figure.
Found this in our boy's car. Mean anything to you? It means what we're after is in the doll. The distributor was ripped out of the other car. Juvenile stunt. Wait a minute. That old Plymouth we found were those Honor Farm shirts. Those kids could be with them. Which way would they go, Trout? North, probably. We didn't pass them, and the other way is blocked. Could be they took the old road past Travis's cabin. All right, Maddo, you and I will go in the car. Trout, form up a search party. We'll find them if they're in this area. Right. Unit 1B1, unit 1B2, we'll meet you. Well, how does it feel to be big time, smart boy? Let him go, Ernie. They're just kids. They're just three pellets in the gas chamber to me. All right, in. Oh, look, mister, we won't talk. Honest, we won't. That's right. You won't talk. In. Ernie. They can't make it any worse for us if they're caught. Give them a break. I got a strange habit. I like living. Use it if any of them make a wrong move. Take a look around. I'll take the inside. It's empty. Now what? There's only one direction they can go, and that's north.
care to beat it. Go on, get out. Oh, thanks. Thanks, lady. My baby. My little baby. What is it, lady? My baby died, I died too. Not even Ernie could kill that pain. Hurry, get out while you still got a chance. Or took off after a switch. They were heading toward the feed mill. I'm one of the kids that escaped from the honor farm. Get in. cars. All cars. Converge on the Green Valley feed mills. Switchblade killer spotted. 10-4. Stay with the kids. Come on out, killer. Don't shoot, copper. I'm unarmed. 
Come on out. Okay. Thank you. 